Hi guys and girls and welcome to day 10 of my first Game Jam Summer 2019. For today we really don't got much to do. I got my brother to playtest the game yesterday and everything seemed to work fine and I was pretty happy with it. The one thing he told me is it would be nice if you could sprint so I'll be adding that today. And I was maybe thinking of adding some world space UI to tell the player what he needs to do because it's uh, a bit confusing right now if you just get into the game and you really don't know what to do. As I was saying, right here I'll just add a simple if statement that will check if we're pressing a shift. I'll add two new variables for walking and sprinting speed and then I'll just input them down here. Very simple. And in the characters I'll just change the move speed to zero and then I'll change the walk speed to five or actually seven and the sprint speed to like 10. It's not working because I realized I was using get key down instead of get key. My brother also suggested that we create a new script that will allow these blocks, these ground blocks to fall off and not everywhere, maybe just like on some uh, edges, we can add that and then if the player steps on it, he can fail. I'll create a new script and call it ground break. And again, for like the millionth time, this game jam, we have to use private void on trigger enter. That actually seems a bit stupid because I don't feel like doing animations and without animations it won't look good. So we'll just skip over that. So I'll just skip on to adding directions to the... some kind of a tutorial maybe. So I added a world space text element and just placed it here on the wall and now in the game view the player can see that. Get all the characters to the center, use 8 to overlook the level. And those are pretty much the only two things I need to tell them. I mean that's pretty much everything I had uh, written down to do. Except I didn't do the kind of the tricky terrain with uh, the blocks falling off. But maybe I can think of something much better because I don't really like the idea of falling ground plates or tiles. It seems a bit complicated and I don't feel like doing a lot of complication here. It's a simple game jam, it's a small one. And this is it for today. It was a very short video and I think tomorrow we're going to finish up and maybe two days from now we'll uh, submit the game. But hopefully you enjoyed. You can go check out the description for more information about me, about what I do. And hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.